Every day, humans use objects made on a machine tool. A life without machines is a life without objects. Discover the unique life of a machinist. This is Cycle Start. Hey, I'm Remy Groove from uh, Groove Machining in North Bay, Ontario, and uh, today we're going to be doing some uh, ATV spindles for a job shop that uh, fabricates uh, ATV trailers. Customers supplied me with this uh, sample part of their uh, spindle for their Rocker Beam axle, and uh, they need some parts produced for tomorrow morning. So we don't have time to make prints. We got them print program this right at the machine. All right. So first thing we're going to do is we're gonna quickly measure this part with some uh, few instruments here. We got a screw pitch gauge to define a thread per inch. We got some calipers and a set of micrometers for a bearing diameter where the hub's gonna sit on. We started off with a piece of raw stock here and then we've already uh, done the first operation which is uh, turn some diameters and now we're gonna flip the part around and we have a part stop inside the spindle and we're going to clamp and do the second operation. The first step is we're going to establish our parts, part zero. So we're going to grab the part, put it in the chuck, stop, clamp it, and reel in our master tool roughly within zero. Now that we've established our part zero, we're going to set up all the rest of our tools to that point. Now we're going to put our tools in the turret. We like to choke them up as tight as we can for rigidity and as square as we can. Okay. So now that we have all our tools in our turret, we're going to establish our geometry in the tool order. So we have an option here of defining Turning, boring, center drill, drill, threading, grooving. We're going to be doing some turning and also your insert geometry. Which you have diamond, square, triangle, hexagon, pentagon. We'll be using a trigon insert. The insert size of half inch IC and a lead angle of minus five. And then we have a finished turn tool which is a 55 degree diamond, 3 inch IC, and we'll also be using a threading tool, which is sharp V, 100 thou depth, with a 60 degree angle. So now that we have our uh, part set up and our tool library established, we can start programming. The first thing we're going to do, we've got a facing cycle, and a rough profile cycle, finish cycle, and then we'll finish it off with a threading cycle. So now that we're done our program, Check verification for any errors or crashes. Hit auto mode. Close the door. Run program. Cycle start.
Now the part is done, we're going to quickly gauge it with the mating part. Perfect thread. Part's complete. What I like best about being a machinist is there's always something new to learn. Every year there's always something coming out that it's, makes things much easier and much faster and it's always exciting to learn new things and making your job much more easier. The biggest challenges of, a, of being a machinist is uh, nowadays it seems like all the customers are wanting their parts that day or the next day and you've got tight deadlines to meet so it's important to have machines with a fast turnaround to make things a lot easier. Thank you for watching Psycho Start. Be sure you subscribe. Tell us in the comments what machinist application you'd like to see next.